The IU EMPEDS program is the oldest. We were the first. We were the ones that did it over 40 years ago now. Our emergency medicine program and pediatric programs are both recognized as some of the best training programs in the country. So the IU EMPEDS program pulls from the strength of both of those, and I happen to think it's the best EMPEDS training program in the country. The IU School of Medicine is a large medical school and we're part of a big parent organization in Indiana University. As part of that, we have a lot of resources that we can deploy. So as a resident, you'll be staffing one-on-one -on -one in the emergency departments with our faculty. The IU School of Medicine Emergency Medicine faculty comes from all over the country. You'll be training with people who have done subspecialty work in emergency medical services, in toxicology, in the ICU, in pediatric emergency medicine, in ultrasound. These are all fellowships that we offer here and you'll be staffing as a resident. So I think something that is unique to our program is our critical care experience. On the adult emergency medicine side, we work one-on-one -on -one with our ICU attendings and run a team on our own, which you get to get a lot of autonomy and unique experiences. We get that same kind of autonomy in the emergency department itself. And then there's tons of great PEDS experiences too that we get, whether it be in the PICU or on the hospitalist floors or in the Riley ED. So, so many different variety of training and opportunities. I think we really get given a lot of autonomy and a lot of unique experiences to see some really sick patients as well as your bread and butter cases. So the IU School of Medicine is a big campus. We have multiple hospital affiliations. You can see behind me Riley Hospital. Riley is a freestanding children's hospital. We don't have a pediatric floor, we have a pediatric hospital. For the adult experiences, you'll be working mostly at Methodist and Eskenazi. Methodist is our big affiliated tertiary care hospital. Eskenazi is our county hospital. It's a brand new, beautiful county facility with modern, up-to-date facilities that are absolutely beautiful and really amazing. I would challenge you to find anywhere in the country where you have three level one trauma centers within a, a couple of miles of each other, where you're gonna be able to train on any type of patient. So you see a little bit of everything. Our patient population really has very few holes. So not only are you gonna be able to read about the things you're gonna see in your practice, you'll actually get to, to see them in person and practice during residency. So IU is really unique in that we're the one big academic center for the whole state, so it's a wide catchment area of things we get to see in sick patients transferred in from all over the state. We see a diverse array of pathology in patients and large volumes at that, so there's always something to learn from. Every shift, every day on the floor as I learn something new and get to a new experience. I think from an emergency medicine standpoint too, you know, you, you're seeing over 250,000 visits per year between the three different sites. And um, you know, just, just that volume alone guarantees you that you're gonna see everything of what you need to see. You know, I think you, you can't underestimate how much you gain from just seeing lots of different cases. I think that IU will have prepared me outrageously well for practice in both emergency medicine and pediatrics. I think that combined aspect will be a unique asset as I go forward. So the combined program in emergency medicine and pediatrics gives residents the opportunity to train as a pediatrician and as an emergency medicine physician. You are fully embedded in both programs. So when you're thinking about a combined residency, you need to look at both of those residencies as they stand on their own and also as they're combined into a five-year residency. The emergency medicine residency here at IU I think is unmatched. We staff two extremely busy, extremely high acuity, tertiary, quaternary emergency departments and you'll learn to see a lot of patients and treat them with high quality really quickly. And the pediatrics residency, we have a freestanding children's hospital that's a referral center for the entire state. You see all of the unique cases that you might not see in other places that may be more saturated. And you're also gonna see a very high volume in the emergency department, on the wards, in the NICU, in the pediatric intensive care unit. You're gonna get comfortable with all sorts of deliveries and all sorts of extremely sick children. The residents who train here get to rotate on every service and engage in every educational opportunity that their categorical counterparts do. As such, by the time you graduate this program, you are one of the best loved and most highly skilled residents coming out. You have mastered the fields of emergency medicine and general pediatrics, and those are two fields that are pretty complementary to each other. The combination of the program allows us to have a lot of critical care experience and gives you the 
breadth and necessary information to both work like as a hospitalist, which is something I think I want to do, and work likely in the community setting. And it lends itself to being able to do whatever you want afterwards, which I think is the big strength of, of the program. You will be trained to, to basically do whatever you want within pediatrics or emergency medicine. The emergency medicine is so much more than just what happens in the department. We have a disaster medicine training day during our intern orientation. In that day, you will be able to participate in a simulated disaster, perform massive triage and mass casualty assessment at a federally funded training center. We have an EMS experience where I want you to learn how to take apart cars and take the doors off and learn what our EMS and pre-hospital colleagues are doing on the scene because that will make you a better physician when those patients arrive to you in the emergency department. It allows our residents and people that work in the emergency department to understand what our first responders do in order to get our patients to us in the emergency department. I mean, this is what the whole point of our program is, is to show that we doctors don't work in isolation, that we work with the fire service, EMS, our nurses, the respiratory techs, like it's all about a, a healthcare team and this, is, this shows from start to finish what it's going to look like. So our simulation center here at IU is a fully functioning hospital, or it can be a fully functioning hospital. It doesn't feel like you're in a lab or in a false environment when you're doing our simulations here. They've been doing simulation at IU for long enough that they can dial it in and do what they need to do to push you to the next level. The people are what makes it so great. So you have great educators and faculty members who are invested in you as a learner, who want you to learn, and that translates into a fantastic clinical training. Your co-residents become your family, as do the entire community of people here at IU. You're going to be pushed out of your comfort zone, you're going to be challenged, um, but that's really how you learn. And the other part of that is the support that you receive from your fellow residents, from the faculty, from everyone around you in the emergency departments and outside in the community of Indianapolis. Having that support in order to thrive during the challenges that you're going to face during residency is really something that I think is, makes this place special. Moving to a new place like my wife and I did without any family around could have been a, an extremely difficult experience. But everyone, we, we attract residents from all over the nation and you don't need to worry about coming here and feeling alone at any point. I can't imagine a program that fosters that family feeling better than Indiana. I was immediately accepted here as a medical student and that just continued as a resident. Uh, I can honestly say as a third year resident, I feel like the staff are also my friends. I have an enjoyable time working with them. I have an enjoyable time staffing with them. They're the people that I can go to. It's very low stress when I'm staffing with them. It really feels like I'm sitting with a friend and discussing my plan and that's been a really great learning environment for me. A lot of places you train at, they're all regulated by the ACGME, um, which means that they're going to give you what's necessary. But I think the stuff that lifts you up here is you have the three different hospital settings, a great community, you get a fill for inner city, a fill for county, and you get the pediatric specialists. And again, for me, I'd take it any day because the community setting in terms of the family feel that you get is something that I don't think is beat many places. IU is simply the whole package. It's a great place to live. It's a great community of people where you'll get the most excellent training possible. I couldn't be happier with the training I've gotten here so far and I'm excited for finishing out the next two years here. It's really the best place, I think, to train for emergency medicine and pediatrics. If you want to become an outstanding emergency physician, you can do it here. You can do whatever you want to set your mind to. We have the facilities, we have the personnel. We can, we can help you make that a reality and we hope that you give us that chance. So if you want to spend five years in residency, you want to end that five years being the best emergency physician and the best pediatrician and the best combined doctor you can be. You don't want to waste those five years. And if you come to IU, I guarantee that you will leave that five years feeling like the best out there and a leader in the field nationally. We're looking for people who are excited about both specialties. You have to be excited about emergency medicine and pediatrics because you are a pediatric resident and an emergency medicine resident. We're looking for people who want to make a difference. 
One of the hallmarks of our training is that we will train you to work in solo independent practice if that's what you choose, because that's the hardest venue to work. We're looking for people who are go-getters, energetic, creative, and we invite you to come be a part of our IU EMPs family.